Rocco Rodemau, Inchino, Musica Feliz. I don't hear this track played enough when I go out, man. I don't hear this track played enough. I don't know why, but you gotta play it, man. You gotta play it. Maybe I go to too many Afro House, Afro Tech events, but I don't hear this track played enough when I go out. I know it's a classic. I know it's an easy track to play and it doesn't really introduce people to new music, but this is one of a handful of tracks that makes you feel a certain type of way. This is one of a handful of tracks that you put up there, top shelf, and you leave up there. You leave it up there in the top shelf. Musica Feliz, Rocco Rodemo, Nainsinia, Alex S, Return to Disco Mix. 2003, guys. 2003, this track came out. 2003. In 2003, what was I doing in 2003? How old was I in 2003? 12? What was I doing at 12 years old? I've got no clue. I couldn't tell you. But almost 20 years ago, this track was released. Timeless, soulful house, classic. To this day, man, to this day, I think this sets the standard for deep, soulful, Cuban, Afro-Cuban, Latin, all of those things. This sound sets the benchmark, sets the tone, is the standard. And of course, Rocco Rodemau, one of the top DJs, producers. I actually forgot to mention Rocco in my French France Deep House video. I got a lot of slack for that. So apologies for not mentioning Rocco, but yeah, I should have mentioned him at the very top because that's where he belongs. And of course, this track speaks to that and speaks for itself. Massive fan of Rocco. So many, so many, so many releases that are top tier. But let's waste no time. Musica Feliz, Rocco, Rodemau, and Insignia. 2003, guys. Again, 2003. What were you doing in 2003? Do you even remember? I don't. I have no clue. I was 12 years old, but I have no clue what was happening in 2003. Anyway, let's listen to some timeless classic sound. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Bonito esse daqui, né? Tanta gente. Uh! Legal. As luzes, a música, o som, a batida. Tô adorando. Tô amando loucamente. I mean, português. That is a very nice sounding language beautiful voice i'm just like ooh, keep talking wow 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 <sighs> yeah it makes you want to learn portuguese doesn't it it's good dj me dê a batida Gente 
gente dançando Bonita a festa, né? Gosto da galera, gente bonita Do DJ, a música, o som, as luzes Gostei, tá tudo super bem DJ, toca pra mim, vai! A batida, o som, a galera A música trying to use my Italian to understand what she's saying but I don't it's so good though I mean I wonder how many people how many couples have met on the dance floor while this was playing it's that type of tune though it just puts you in that type of you know okay let me see what's going on you know what I mean it's like okay let me have a look around of course if you're single you know what I'm saying if you're single then you know you get that wandering eye and you're like, okay, what's around? This is that type of tune, man. You just, you want to dance with someone, you want to ask them how they're doing, all of that, man. This is, yeah, it creates that environment, that atmosphere. It's cool, man. I like it a lot. Musica feliz. Musica feliz. Let me know in the comments the first time that you heard this track and what you thought. Is this a classic to you? Why is it a classic? Let's create a conversation because I do want to know how it makes you feel. If you've got any stories, who played this track? What DJ played this track for you? How you heard it? All of that. Um, but for me... I think I heard this track on a live stream the first time. I forget which one it was, but I think it was a live stream. And I was like, yeah. Took my phone out, shazammed it. I was like, okay, now we're talking. 
this is what I need, man. This is the one. Of course, the vocal is everything. The vocal is everything. And she's singing, but at the same time, she's talking, I think, to the DJ or whoever. And I think that balance between having a conversation and singing is very cool. And that works really well, I think, when you have a very, I guess, sexy voice singing, not singing, but talking on a Deep House track. That usually works. I think when someone takes someone talking in a cool way, especially a female voice, and puts it in a Deep House or a Soulful House track, that is usually a banger. Classic. I'm not sure how many times I used that word in this video, but again, classic, classic, classic track. And very spontaneous, right? The vocal, everything, the instruments in the background, everything seems improvised, natural, organic. It's cool. It's cool. And I think in this day and age, it's very difficult to get that type of natural organic sound in productions if you have the opportunity of stepping out of your studio and you know using real instruments working with a cool vocalist tapping into that natural sound do it do it because it resonates people feel it and you know that spontaneity that um organic feel you can't put a price on it you can't put a price on it so do it if you can and yeah that was musica feliz rock and roll in senior portuguese vibes afro-cuban latin deep house soulful lots of colors lots of subgenres in here but all around timeless classic